Harvard President Claudine Gay has announced her resignation, citing a focus on the institution rather than any individual. This comes after weeks of criticism, including allegations of plagiarism and her handling of campus tensions. Gay was the second Ivy League president to resign following a congressional hearing on campus anti-Semitism. Some questioned whether she was held to a different standard because of her race. The fallout has intensified national debates over freedom of speech and diversity in schools. Gay expressed her deep connection to Harvard, but also mentioned personal attacks fueled by racial animus. She will return to Harvard's faculty, and Alan M. Garber will serve as interim president. The Harvard Corporation accepted her resignation with sorrow and condemned the attacks directed at her. The controversy also led to an investigation by the House Education and the Workforce Committee. The committee called on Harvard, Penn, and MIT to remove their presidents. Gay's resignation received mixed reactions, with some seeing it as a necessary step. Concerns about campus culture and freedom of speech have been ongoing at Harvard. Jewish groups like the Simon Wiesenthal Center welcomed her resignation. Criticism of Gay's handling of campus tensions and her comments at the congressional hearing grew. Some believe her resignation raises questions about the vulnerability of black female leaders. Overall, the controversy surrounding Gay's resignation has highlighted larger societal issues.